And so on the outdoor faucets, um, you want to turn them on, make sure they're functioning full blown, but I would not necessarily leave them on a drip because they have little uh, vacuum breakers or siphoning devices that if not enough water flow is going through, it'll actually freeze up the vacuum breaker and you'll have to replace it. But you definitely want to disconnect the hoses off of those outdoor spigots. Outdoor faucets, whatever you want to call them, hose bibs, you want to definitely disconnect the hose because that will also back up water into the actual um, frost proof hose bibs and cause them to split. And so, but um, I would never necessarily recommend just leaving them on real slow drip. Either turn them on, keep obviously water flow going through them, and then turn them off completely and disconnect all hoses. Would you like wrap them or like styrofoam? Oh yeah, yeah, definitely wrap them, put your styrofoam. That's gonna remind you to take your hose off because when you put the insulation on, wrap it over, you have to disconnect the hose to get that bad oil on there. So for sure, uh, definitely insulate the best you can. Uh, like I say, you can even put space heaters um, inside of your cabinets to keep it up. Like I said, the exterior wall is as warm as we can get it above freezing. So that's gonna help a lot.